Historically, we've had a very centralized egress infrastructure. We backhauled traffic from remote offices to uh, central locations, had a physical stack of security appliances, uh, DLP, firewalls, IPSs, uh, malware analysis, sandboxes, all best of breed products that, you know, we had selected over time and, uh, uh, you know, served us well for many years. As we started to shift how our business worked, and adopt more cloud platforms, that architecture really limited and complicated our ability to adopt software-defined networks and uh, uh, enhance our uh, user experience for those users of cloud platforms. The cloud-based architecture that we get with Zscaler allows us to be very flexible, really in an unprecedented way, and to accommodate changes in network design and traffic patterns for end users. Uh, and enhance that end user experience. So that flexibility has really, really been key for us. We actually have seen a pretty significant security improvement uh, as well. Uh, you know, that best of breed stack that I talked about, it really limited us uh, into physical infrastructure. So, you know, upgrades and changes made uh, adoption of new capabilities pretty difficult very expensive, very labor intensive, things that we had to plan out over 18 or 24 months uh, to be able to accomplish from a funding perspective and deploying the change perspective. So Zscaler's platform allows us to get those features and functions as fast as we can adopt them. It's available to us immediately and globally uh, all at the same time. My team was, was managing physical infrastructure. We don't have to do that anymore with, with Zscaler. We were able to consolidate about nine different relationships down to one. And so we really simplified the work that the security team had to do in managing that egress security model. We really embraced zero trust uh, in our uh, M&A environment. Uh, so where we have acquisitions has always created a lot of friction. Uh, and, uh, you know, we've had to make some compromises at times that we just really didn't feel good about uh, in order to facilitate business. So, you know, the zero trust model allows us to, uh, to get those acquired entities into some of our systems securely, uh, frictionless, quickly, uh, sometimes the same week that the deal closes. Uh, wow. You know, you're providing access into some of our uh, sales and, and finance system. So, uh, you know, I, I think it can be a really big business enabler as well as uh, a security benefit, uh, you know, to, to help streamline some of the processes.